Hallelujah, praise Master Jesus. Watch out, this is about your job. It's a warning. Watch out, this is about your job. God bless each and every one. In Jesus' mighty name, amen. Please, I would really like us to follow this word from the beginning to the end. Praise Master Jesus. This message is a warning. And one thing I tell people, whenever God sends a word of warning, it calls for concern. It's because God does not want it to happen. Praise Master Jesus. Whenever you see in the Bible, whenever in the Bible the Lord destroy any place, a notice was sent to the people and the people ignore the voice and the word of the Lord. When God wanted to destroy the people of Nini, the people of Nini knew it. They repented. God forgive them. When God wanted to destroy uh, the life of King Ezekiah, he prayed to the Lord. Praise Master Jesus. So God is warning you about your job. It does not matter how hard or how painful the word might come to you. But listen to me. My purpose and my joy is the vitamin. It's not the pain of the, of the world. It's the treatment of the, of the antibiotics that the Lord is giving you through, through this word. So this word to you is like an injection that is like an antibiotics to your system. No matter how painful the injection is, why receiving the injection, but... Our purpose, our goal is the result. Praise Master Jesus. It's about your job. In Jesus' mighty name. There is somebody watching me. You have been joking with your destiny. You have been joking with your jobs. You have been playing with what God has blessed you with. And the Lord is sounding this word as a warning to you. The Lord says you need to be very careful with your job. Watch out. The Bible talks in, the, in a parable whereby... Jesus said the kingdom of God is like a master who was about to, to travel to a far country. He called his servant. So to his servant, he gave to any man according to his ability. So the, the master knew that the man of five has the capacity to multiply five. The man of two has the capacity to multiply two. The man of one has the capacity to multiply one. So it was not because of selfish interest. The Bible says he gave to any man according to their capacity. That means even if the man could give the one of five to the man of one, he will waste it because he will not still multiply. So after which he has given them this gift, this particular money, the Bible says the man of five multiplied to ten, the man of two multiplied, the man of one buried. When you look properly in, in, in the life of the, the man of one, is this type of people that love gossip. They don't love to walk. They love to look on, look in people's things and gossip, say what they don't supposed to say, complain, murmur, gossip. Why others are struggling? At least the one you have multiply it. Why? I'm bringing this scripture here so that the person this word is going to, you need to be very careful. Praise Master Jesus. You cannot labor for quite a long time and God bless you with a job and you're neglecting your job. You don't need to neglect your job. While you were suffering, no company was there to hire you. But when this company took you, hire you, did everything for you, now people are deceiving you outside. That do like this, we are going to do like this, we are going to do like this. Listen to me. No matter what you do, you need to be very careful. Because the decision you are taking today is like a woman. When you are married, another man might see you outside saying, please do like this, do like this. They will be pretending to you. They just want you to leave your house. When, once you leave the house, they will show you the color whereby you ask yourself, if I have known, I will have stayed back. Praise Master Jesus. The Lord is warning you. Do not play with your job. Do not neglect your job. Before you take any decision concerning your job, make sure you seek God's approval. Make sure you seek the face of God. Make sure you ask God, Father, what is your own opinion? Praise Master Jesus. No matter the challenges, no matter the problem, no matter the temptation, seek God's approval in Jesus' mighty name. Amen and amen. I pray for somebody watching and connecting. The Lord revealed to redeem. I pray for you. May you not lose your job in Jesus' name. I pray for any attack of the enemy against your job. It will not prevail in the mighty name of Jesus. God bless each and everyone that has been connecting, helping, sustaining this ministry financially. God bless you all. May God bless the moderators, the members, and the subscribers. 
in Jesus' mighty name. Amen and amen.